Well, I got a new uh, new project. Uh, I'm going to be fabricating uh, an intake tube here for my uh, 2007 uh, GMC Sierra with the 5.3. On here, I've already got the uh, factory intake uh, tube removed, and I've got uh, a reducer right here. This is four inch down to three and a half inch, and over here on the mass airflow sensor body, I've got a coupler which is really three and a half to three and a half. This is a bit of a snug fit. This mass airflow body does measure out to three and five eighths of an inch. Uh, so it is a snug fit, which is good. It, it means it's airtight. Uh, you just kind of got to muscle it on there. I thought I would need some heat uh, to kind of stretch it out a little bit, but I didn't. Uh, I got it on there just fine. So there's the truck. There's the old intake tube right there with all its little silencers and, and whatever else are on there. And uh, here's the parts fabricate the new one. This is all three and a half inch, uh, uh, I got a straight piece and two mandrel bent pieces, a, a U-bend and uh, this one 90 degree bend. Uh, this large U-bend has a seven, uh, seven inch radius. Uh, this tighter 90 degree bend, I don't know, it, it doesn't mention what the radius is, um, but it's far less than seven inches. I would say it's probably about four inches. So uh, those are the parts that I'm using. So uh, let me go ahead and get started on this. So I set this uh, large U-bend in here just to uh, sort of give you a reference. I'm going to probably start over here on the mass airflow sensor side and work my way over to the throttle body side. Now I have to make a bridge over this upper radiator hose. So what I'm going to start with, I might be able to do this whole project just with this one piece of tubing. Uh, but like I said, I'm going to start over here on the, the uh, mass airflow side. So I need to have a bend come up and over that uh, upper radiator hose. So what I'm probably going to do is cut off, it's looking like at least five, maybe six inches of the leg of this U-bend uh, uh, to, uh, to start with and then I'll probably cut it somewhere in that area, uh, not going 90 degrees up, probably 40 to 45 degrees over and then I'll take another section of this which will then be welded the section coming off of the mass airflow sensor up to there and then on over to the throttle body so uh, let me make some cuts and uh, we'll keep going here's a little trick I like to do when I'm cutting uh, any kind of round tubing I'll use tape and it helps make you uh, make a straight line you wrap it around and the edges of the tape meet up which they almost do here I'm only off by about a sixteenth of an inch uh, then you know if you cut along that tape then you're cut all the way around uh, the piece of tubing uh, should be fairly straight and uh, you can always level it off uh, with just a flap wheel. 